Hi, I'm Daryl Popper, AIFD, floral designer and visual display artist at Shinoda Design Center. Today I'm going to show you how to do a hand tied that we use at the bottom of some of our poles in our display to finish off the bottom of our displays. I'm going to take some of our beautiful holly we have for Christmas. This is all hand wrapped. All the leaves individually wired. Isn't that gorgeous? And then we have beautiful poinsettias, same thing. So I'm going to take these, they're all hand, hand tied. I'm going to put them in my hand. Beautiful fronds in gold. Add a couple more poinsettias. Now we can shape these again afterwards when we're all done because the wires are all individually wired all the way down. More holly. A little bit of lime green. The display that we're gonna be using in this in has lime green, red, and gold. I think lime green is our new emerald green that we've used for Christmas for so many years. Very traditional color and the beautiful antique gold foliage that we're gonna use at the bottom. Now this is a really interesting component. You'll see in our display, this is what we've used on the tree. We're gonna repeat a couple of these in our hand tied for the bottom to repeat, repeat the same components that we have in our tree. Everything will be cohesive. Now I'm gonna take wire. This will be what we're gonna use on the bottom. We're gonna band it all together. Twist it tight. I'm gonna do one more. When one is good, a whole lot more is better. Okay, now we're gonna open up all of the bouquet that we've done. All of our flowers, hopefully we have twisted these around, opened them all. Now we're gonna shape this before we put it on our end cap. And this is our finished hand tied. Now this could be used at a home in a residence. It could be used, the stems could be cut, dropped in a vase, be used on a side table, on a buffet. Could be used on a lamp post. Could be used out front, maybe on a small mailbox near your front door. Be even pretty as a door piece with a bow on it, long streamers hanging down. A lot of ways, it's just your imagination. That's what's gonna tell the story. Here's our hand tied that I just finished to tie in with our whole display, but it really looks unfinished. You can see the bottom of it. So I'm going to add something to finish up the bottom to have a finished product. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a bow. I'm using the same material as I used in my display, a ribbon. Now this one is very one-sided. So remember when I showed you how to make a bow before, we're gonna use front side, good side towards you, fold it in, pinch, Good side towards you, back, pinch. Good side towards you, pinch. This ribbon is really easy, it's very flexible. Remember, we've got some how-to series on how to make a bow. Be sure to check us out. I think I'm gonna make two or three streamers on this. Leave the tails long, more dramatic. Wire, remember right through the middle of our bow, through the back. Streamers are included. Pull your wire, your ribbon towards you, real tight with your bow, and then shape your loops. Put this right at the bottom of our hand tied. We'll dovetail again the bottom of our ribbons. Remember, fold your ribbon in half, front tight side towards you. In the middle, cut it. And we're done. 
Daryl Boper, AIFD, floral designer and visual display artist at Shinoda Design Center. Be sure to come by and check us out and see all the new designs we're going to be doing for Christmas. Stay tuned for more end caps, more floral fun, and lots of things to share with you. Have a great day.